Hi, beloved in the Lord. My name is A. This is Heavenly Host Vision with Lydia. I'm so glad to welcome you to yet another prophetic word. May the Almighty God bless you and keep you safe, sound, and protected. If you've been feeling so down, so like you've been going through a breakdown or sad situations, or you know that someone I know has been trying to get back into your space, losses, someone has been trying to get back into your space. But they have been denied access in Jesus' mighty name. Thank you, Lord. It is time that a lot of people are thinking about the past, past situations, past ones, trying to show off, whatever. But there's a particular person that you let that you don't that it doesn't work out well, well with. This is not just an ordinary person. This is someone that you know, made you, that made you to learn hard lesson in life. This person made you to have hard to, to experience hard to go through hard lesson in life. And as time has gone by, if it's like you, you know, you know, forgiving this person, you are beginning to have compassion on this person, you begin to like, okay, you want to move on with your life. I don't want to hold grudges on people and things like that. And it seems like you're beginning to like, okay, you're thinking about this, yeah, like you've been thinking about the person, like trying, trying to make sure the person is is okay, or if not even okay, but the truth is that this person has been trying to manifest you back in their life. Oh my God, you try to be at peace with someone, not that you have this mind to go back to them, but they are taking it the wrong way. Someone is taking what your kindness towards them after a long while, or someone is is like thinking that because. You decided to make peace with them means that you want to come back into your life and that in their head they're beginning to think that perhaps you want to get back one you want to come back together and they have been trying to manifest your losses please this person is not supposed to be in your life oh my god it doesn't, it doesn't matter how they have tried to change and it make you feel like everything is okay losses please resist the devil resist the devil according to james 4 verse 7 resist this devil and shall flee from you Submit therefore to God, resist the devil, and he will flee from you. No, you can't say hello to someone. And this person wants to be like, hello, how are you? Can we have dinner together? Oh, can we do this? It's like we're just waiting for you to say hello. <laughs> Love it. It's, just, it's quite tempting. You have forgiven them. You have no God. You, have no God, God, you, have, you bear no God against them. Losses, please. The hello was enough. The halo was enough. Nothing more. Nothing more. Yes. Hallelujah. Please resist the devil. The halo was enough. Lord says, please. The, devil, the halo was enough. Resist the devil. That trying to manifest you and it shall flee from you. Don't go back there. You've done your best. You've released them. You've been so kind to them. It's time to move on. Hallelujah. Let them not extend the halo. Let them not turn the halo into something. No, it can't go beyond halo. It can't go beyond halo. In Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. See you in the next video.